confirmed that a new variant of the virus had been identified in the UK and on Tuesday I advised Parliament that a small number of cases of that new strain had already been identified in Scotland. The information that I and my Cabinet have received today about the new variant of the COVID virus uh, that has been identified in the UK suggests to me that we do now face a very serious situation. It is, in fact, probably the most serious and potentially dangerous juncture we have faced since the start of the COVID pandemic. Uh, firstly, we are asking everyone uh, to redouble your personal efforts in sticking to the rules and following facts. That may sound obvious, but it is really important. Secondly, in order to reduce the risk of more of this strain being imported into Scotland, we intend to maintain a strict travel ban between Scotland and the rest of the UK. Unfortunately, and I am genuinely sorry about this, that ban will remain in place right throughout the festive period. We simply cannot risk more of this new strain entering the country if we can possibly avoid it. Given the concern we now have about this new strain, we now intend to change the law to allow indoor uh, mixing in a bubble on Christmas Day only, uh, from midnight or a minute past midnight on Christmas Day to uh, midnight uh, going into Boxing Day. At this stage, there is no evidence to suggest that this new strain of the virus causes more severe illness. And there is no evidence at this stage to suggest that the new strain will affect the effectiveness of the vaccines that are being developed or indeed the vaccine that is currently in use in Scotland. Uh, and all of that is reassuring, although further analysis is underway. However, there is strong evidence now that the new strain is spreading substantially and significantly more quickly than the strains of the virus that we have been dealing with up to now. The advantage that we have in Scotland, uh, unlike some other parts of the UK right now, is that we still do have the chance to act on a preventative basis.